What's going on guys? It's that guy with movies back here again. Today we're going to be doing another brand new unboxing. This time it's going to be on the 4K Ultra HD plus Blu-ray plus digital combo pack of, because you gotta yell it, Shazam! So without further ado, we'll get started with the slipcover first. So of course, you know what we have up there. Uh, just hold on, get a little bit more light in here. It is looking pretty dark, but there we go. So yeah, of course what we have up here... Uh, DC Shazam, and then we've got Shazam himself right there, just going on his phone and chewing some bubble gum. And uh, this is this is pretty much the uh, poster for the movie, anyways. But we have a sticker down here includes the exclusive motion comic superhero hookie, so uh, that's pretty interesting. So anyway, though, uh, here is the spine right here, 4K Ultra HD Shazam, uh, DC and Warner Brothers, and this is going really out of focus here. Uh, yeah, DC and Warner Brothers, and then uh, pretty much the exact same thing on the other side, 4K Ultra HD, Shazam, and then DC and Warner Brothers logo. So now we will take a look at the back here. Uh, we have a quote up here from uh, Mara Reinstein of US Weekly saying, It is a surefire crowd pleaser. And there is the uh, description of the movie if you want to pause and read that if you want. Uh, if you guys have not seen Shazam yet, so there you go. And we have a picture here of, uh, and that's Freddy and then Shazam right there with his uh, lightning hands. And then we have another quote down here from Mara, uh, same, same person here, nothing can destroy the magic in Shazam. And now we will take a look at the special features here. So more than 90 minutes of supercharged special features, uh, including an exclusive motion comic superhero hooky. So like I just said there. Uh, alternate opening and ending, deleted scenes, gag reel, audition footage, on set with Zachary Levi, and Shazam's backstory. So, we've got a pretty decent amount of special features on this uh, Blu-ray here. I'm sure those are probably all on the Blu-ray and not on uh, the 4K. But we have a really nice kind of shiny slipcover here as well. Uh, digital movie, watch anywhere, so as usual, and then just what you need for you know the complete 4K experience. And if we go down here, we'll take a look at the specifications. Uh, we have 2160p ultra high definition, 16 by 9 widescreen with an aspect ratio of 240 to 1. Uh, we have a Dolby Atmos True HD track on here, as well as a 5.1 descriptive audio track, a English, French, and Spanish 5.1 Dolby Digital track. And for subtitles, we have the usual English, French, and Spanish. And pretty much the exact same specifications with the Blu-ray as well, but it is just in 1080p high definition uh, instead of, you know, 2160p. And if you're also, if your TV is equipped, uh, this Blu-ray or this 4K does come with Dolby Vision as well. And uh, the movie is 132 minutes, so it is just over two hours long. And uh, yeah, anyway though, that is about it for the specifications of Shazam. So, uh, anyway, though, I'll just take the slipcover off here and put it right there. And this is pretty much what it looks like without the uh, slipcover or anything. So, uh, you know, there you have it. Sorry, I have to keep trying to, like, because my phone doesn't autofocus. So, uh, I have to, like, kind of constantly keep hitting the focus button. But, uh,. Yeah, anyway, though, that is, uh, you know, what it looks like unwrapped, so I will just uh, bring my trusty knife here, and we will just slice this down the middle, as we usually do. And uh, have you guys seen Shazam? What did you think of it? Did you guys get a chance to see it in theaters? Uh, let me know down below in the comments. I will let you guys know what I thought of it in just a couple short moments here. I'll just put all this aside. And we just have a little bit there, and a little bit there, and unfortunately, uh, we have a little rip in the, or a little ding in the, the plastic, I guess. But anyway, though, that's all what it looks like, so I'll just bring this off camera really quick, just to take out the code here, and, uh, you know, that's pretty much what it looks like, just reading your digital movie Shazam, and then... Uh, you know, all that info, your source for all things Warner Brothers, and that's about it for the insert there. And if we take a look at what we have in here, uh, this is what the uh, 4K disc looks like here. So we have 
the uh, lightning bolt design there. We have Shazam, and then you know, New Line Cinema, DC, 4K, all the logos right there, and uh, pretty much the exact same thing, but it's inverted for the Blu-ray. So there is pretty much the exact same design with the lightning bolt and everything. So that is about it for this unboxing of the 4K Ultra, or the unboxing portion of this video. So now we will get on to, uh, you know, my kind of little mini review that I always do. So what I thought of Shazam, I saw this movie in theaters uh, when it came out back in April, I believe. I can't believe this movie's already out. It's, it kind of feels like a couple days ago that I went to go see this. But anyway, though, I saw it in 3D back in April. And uh, was not really expecting too much from this. It kind of looked like a fun time from the trailers and everything, but nothing like I, uh, you know, came out of the theater expecting. Uh, but then I went to I went to go see it, and when I came out, I absolutely loved this movie. It was everything that uh, you know Shazam movie should be. I'm not really familiar with the character, but. You know, it was just a, a really fun time. I really loved it, and, uh, you know, it's just kind of the movie that DC needed because they finally had a critically acclaimed movie, but unfortunately, in the way of box office, did not really earn too much. I believe it only earned, like, $360 million or something like that, but it was a really fun time. I really enjoyed it. Zachary Levi did a great job as Shazam himself, as did Asher Angel, as Billy Batson, and, you know, Mark Strong as Savannah is the highlight of this movie. Uh, Mark Strong is amazing in everything he's in. And, uh, you know, probably quickly becoming one of my favorite actors of this generation. And, you know, other the other members of the Shazam family, they did a pretty decent job as well. But th this was just uh, a really funny movie. Just I had a lot of fun with it and highly recommend watching it if you have not seen it yet. Uh you know, definitely, you know, rent it from the library or even just go out and buy the Blu-ray or something. But it, it was just a really fun time. I really loved it. And, you know, just the uh, just the movie that the DC Extended Universe needed. And I actually thought it was the better Captain Marvel movie because Shazam was once called Captain Marvel. But unfortunately, they got into some legal trouble, not with Marvel, I believe, but with another company. They got into some legal trouble, and they just recently changed uh, Shazam's name to Shazam instead of Captain Marvel. But uh, I actually thought this was the better Captain Marvel of the two. I, I liked it a lot better than Disney's Captain Marvel. But anyway, though, guys, that is about it for this unboxing. It was a little bit shorter than most of them because, you know, there wasn't really too much, I guess, to talk about. But uh, that's about it for this unboxing, so thanks for watching. Be sure to like, subscribe, comment, share. Twitter and Instagram links will be in the description down below if you want to follow me on there. Also, be sure to check out my IMDb profile page. The link for that will be down below in the description of this video as well to see what I've been watching recently. Also, be sure to, if you're new to my channel, also be sure to click the notification bell as well to get notified of future videos, a new video every Tuesday and Friday. So anyway, though, guys, that is about it. Thanks for watching. We'll see you all next time.